Welcome back. Quick video on 1149 today. I just wanted to take a video to see how FSD would handle a small amount of snow. My trusted TK421 is an all-wheel drive Model Y. I've got some Michelin X ice on the vehicle. My first thoughts are that the car just cuts through snow like butter, but I'd have to take it through some more intensive snow whenever that comes just to make sure. Let's see how it handles the slick conditions on this quick drive. You may not be able to see it, but it actually is snowing right now. The wipers are going, there's precipitation falling, the roads are a little bit slick right now. So I'm looking to see how FSD uh, keeps the distance between the vehicles in front and behind it. Right now it's staying in the left lane and it's keeping good distance. I'm driving in average mode right now, it doesn't need to be too aggressive. My next turn is going to be a right turn, it's going to come up in a couple of minutes. So we'll see when FSD does make that turn uh, and shift into the right lane. Right now, everything's going well, no issues. You can safely see the cars in front of me. No cars right now on the right or behind me, so we're all good. Uh, we have a few seconds before we're gonna have to get into that right lane though, so let's see when FSD makes that change. Not feeling any sliding here. Everything's going nice and smooth so far. Very happy with the performance. FSD is going to have to get into that right lane though. There's no vehicles right now that should be preventing it going into the right lane, so would like to see that happen. Well, FSD is now signaling to get into the right lane, but it's doing it right here uh, at an intersection, right where the highway ramp is uh, leading to the road, and that's a big no-no. Let's look back at this in slow motion so you can see what FSD did incorrectly. As you can see there, that's a basic rule. You're not supposed to be doing lane changes right in the middle of the intersection. You saw that car there on the right. He's getting off the highway right now. He could turn right thinking that there's no one in that right lane and FSD just moved me right in front of him. So that's a big no-no. So I'm gonna ding FSD big time on that. That's just a basic rule that it should know. We're gonna continue with the drive right now. You can see on the map that my right turn is gonna be coming up. It's gonna take me into a small development uh, with some unplowed streets, so there'll be a little bit more snow there. So let's see how FSC manages that. Okay, moving into the right lane, nice and gentle. Okay, we're getting to a red light here. We've got some cars on the left. Let's see if they're gonna go through. FSD is gonna do a full stop and wait. All right, sees that those cars aren't going through, does a nice smooth right turn. And okay, you can look here on the roads, a little bit difficult to see any lanes there. We've got a vehicle in front of us. We've got some snowy conditions. FSD slowing down. It's doing a good job. That car is moving slowly. FSD now can see the lines staying comfortably in the right side, doing a good job. Good distance management with the vehicle in front of it. So that's excellent. It's adapting well to the conditions right here. We're gonna be doing a left turn coming up right there, so let's see how that goes. Again, not feeling any issues there with the traction on the car. Again, this is not a massive amount of snow, but it's enough to make it very slick and can affect braking. Okay, we're gonna come up to a stop. Let's see how it stops, good. Slows down well, and well behind that vehicle. That's that vehicle pass. We actually have a vehicle on the right there that is looking to make a left turn there. He's got the right of way, but he seems to be waiting for me. FST is moving forward, trying to determine what that vehicle is trying to do. And FST makes a decision to move forward. So that was good that it did that. It was excellent that it did that. That person was being a little apprehensive there and waiting. They did have the right of way and I was gonna let them go, but uh, they were staying there and FST decided to make the decision. All in all, though, on this quick drive, FSD did relatively well, but there was that big issue, though, with crossing the intersection and doing the lane change at the same time, so I'm going to have to ding it on that. I'm driving with my wife in the car right now, so I will pass the feedback over to her. Again, appreciate you joining me on this drive. Would love to hear your feedback on how your Tesla is managing these cold and slippery conditions that seem to be affecting lots of locations in the United States and Canada. Drive safe, and I'll see you on the roads. Uh, it made a the change lane. Yeah, in, in the middle of the intersection. That's yeah, a, that was not. Yeah, trust me, I'm noting that. That was the only thing it did. That was kind of like, why are you doing the change now? I understand. Like, yeah, it's never done that before. That's full path.
Yeah, that's a phone. That, 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 that'll get you a ticket.